You need to play Baldur's Gate 3. I am playing Baldur's Gate 3. I just haven't played in a minute. Oh. There we go. All right. Welcome to Chestnut Ridge. We are here with the Eras family, uh, who are teens now. So we got Mary Eras. She's the mother. Uh, we've got, the, she looks really young, though, to be having these teen kids. Steven Eras, they almost look her age. Steven Eras is her older son. And Juliet Eras is our current new heir of the challenge so we're gonna be playing as juliet for the most part although um our mom is like dating someone new so we might you know go on some days with him you know um but let me look up the rules for this challenge for this era so we are now entering generation two which is the fearless generation the rules are that we must complete the serial romantic aspiration, experience at least two significant breakups, have three best friends, join a social career like social media or entertainment, max charisma and comedy skills, and have children with your teenage love. Uh, I did ask for some of you to upload Sims, uh, teen Sims for the challenge. Uh, you can use upload using hashtag Kelsey Eras or Kelsey Eras challenge. I, I, I used both when I asked for them. I just got a haircut that you took so much. Oh, I hate it. Oh no. Well, luckily it will grow back, but I'm very sorry that you don't like your haircut. You know, you can always get some pretty good um, clip-in extensions on Amazon. Surprisingly, one of my friends got some and they looked great. So uh, maybe it's time to experiment with some clip-in extensions if you're really feeling that. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, Chelsea, thank you so much for sending all of these marvelous things, team bracelets and set marvelous, what is this, marvelous confetti? Love it. Uh, Stephanie Rocks, thank you so much for the resub. Appreciate you guys. Um, there's a Taylor Swift Eras challenge. Yes, it is a 10 generation challenge and each generation is themed after a different era. I sometimes need to think before I speak. Okay. <laughs> I was like, ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. my mouth was just running uh, in a direction. You're making me want to do my hair. Ooh, you should. I made a bestie for Juliet, one potential love interest friend, and their teens and cuties. Perfect, Emma. I will be checking those out in just a few short minutes. Uh, I do want to add them to our, our like high school and everything. Uh, but I'm going to give you guys a few minutes if you want to still submit some Sims. Maybe you forgot. Make your little teen Sims and put in little, pop in little stories because I love it when you guys have ideas. So we need a, a, a love that she's going to have her kids with. Um, so here's Juliet. She's our main character. She is beautiful. She's a little princess. And here is Steven. This is Steven, her brother. Um, they are not twins. He is an older brother, but they did age up on the same day. Um, because I was ready for them to be teens. And this is their mom who does not look much older than them, but is she's got baby face for real, for real. This is their mom, Mary, who is a celebrity musician. Um, she was the debut era. And we have finished up her requirements uh, for her era. But we do we do have her newly dating uh, our, our dream man, Drew. Um, he's loyal, a rancher, and something else. Um, but he loves, uh, us. We're, we have amazing compatibility. We're sweethearts. He has a key to our house and he's our boyfriend and we adore him and grow closer from quality time with him. Uh, my son also really likes, uh, Drew, they're friends. Uh, they also have some sentiments together. So very cute. Very, very cute. Um, so everyone's vibing. <clears throat> we don't really need these anymore. So put those away. Um, we actually should probably upgrade the bedroom because they're teens now. So it's time for a teen bedroom makeover. I believe the house is still a tiny home. Is, is it? Yeah. Yeah, it's still a small home. So I don't really want to mess with the sizing of any of it personally. Um, but yeah, so we're going to delete some of these objects. Sorry, I'm not sorry. We maybe keep this. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put the other stuff in the inventory. Things I wanna keep. Not open not. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do maybe like they both get an end of the room. Maybe. I don't know. 
We could still do bunk beds and then have like a hangout area too. I haven't decided at the moment to be quite honest. Put that in the inventory and pop it back in. There we go. Okay. We will randomly sell these objects that we have in here. Got these end tables. This is so cute. I've been waiting to use this still, but maybe we'll use it in our house. Honestly, it was like, oh, we have some stuff if we wanted to like actually adopt a horse. Well, if our if our boyfriend moves in, then maybe we'll hold that for when our boyfriend moves in. When slash if, right? I love your vids, but I never see you stream. Welcome. I'm glad that you're here. Okay. So let me think about this. Thinking, thinking. Like what? How do I want to organize this little room here? Like we could put the beds over here. Oops. Put the beds like this way. You know, like that. And then we'd have like more room over here. You know what I mean? Cause like, hold on. Okay, we need like BB move objects on testing sheets on BB move objects on. Perfect. Okay. All right, so we're gonna kind of move. Oh, hello. There it is. Okay, I was like, what am I doing right now? All right, so yeah, so it's like that. And then over here, we can kind of have a hang area, maybe? Double loft beds. You could also have double loft beds and they each have their own little space underneath the loft bed. That is also a thing we could do. But, hmm, yeah, maybe we'll, maybe we'll have them have different sides of the room. Although I love this bed for her. We'll see how it goes. Um, let's see what the other loft beds look like. Here they are. There's like this one. There's like this one, which is the same as our brother. I want hers to look very princessy. I mean, there's this. Wee. Hmm. That one. Oh, there's the ranching one, the ranch one. That one's kind of cute. I want to see what colors it comes in. Look how a cute pink one. Cute pink one, white. This one's kind of cute. I love all the horse. Hmm. I guess we could do this. It kind of matches the room. Yeah, I like it okay. That's cute, yeah, in the yellow. And then we'll make the our brother's bed be like same but different. So we'll do this one for our brother, but we'll do it in the blue. I was looking at this like blue one because then, you know, he could have kind of the same wood tone. There you go. Okay. All right. So that's their beds so far. So far, so good. Um, I do want like that cute little teen. Like I love the teen stuff from the um, high school years packs. I love all the teen stuff from this pack. So I might use a lot of this in their build in the room um specifically i wanted like the thing that goes over the bed where is it this thing i wanted to put this thing above her bed like how princessy is that you know Ooh, this one's also really cute it goes almost to the floor this one goes all the way to the floor should we do that where it goes all the way to the floor i feel like that's cute yeah let's do that it's so cute. I wonder if I remove this, how it would look. Oh, it's kind of vibey. Maybe we, maybe we do away with the overhead lights. You know, in 2024, I'm not into the overhead lights anyway. You know what I mean? All right. Okay. Now we need like a, like a desk under here. Like we could, is there a desk from this pack? The horse ranch? There is a horse ranch desk. 
So it will kind of match the bedding, the frame of the bed. Excuse you. Would be this one? No. I think it's this one. Is the bed the matching? Yeah, it's the matching desk. Okay, so they have the matching desk. And then we'll do a little chair. I'll probably do like a high school years chair. I'm pretty sure I have a chair that I like. Yeah, that one's cute. We could do like a fuzzy rug underneath. Cute. For our brother, we'll do a fuzzy rug as well, but maybe we'll do his in a different color. We can do, do white maybe. Oh, she's already white. Maybe we'll do her yellow then and he'll be white. Perfect. And then we'll do the star. The neon star could be like up here, maybe. Bomb. Cute. Okay. And he needs like a chair. Comfort little rolly chair for him. And his can be like this pretty dark blue color. It could be kind of like a another yellow. Um, let me think. Or he could have one of these kind of chairs. Like one of these. That kind of looks cute in his side of the room. Kind of like one of those. Cool. Yeah. Okay. I like this. It's kind of like a cool tone and a warm tone sides of the room. Uh, let's get him a little neon light as well. Which, which one should his be? If you do little clouds, he could do the CDs. He's into horses. And animals. You could do the oh, I like the lightning bolt for him. It's also yellow, so it still works. You know. Um, is there a cloud light for his side? A cloud light that would be kind of cute, huh? I was gonna do a, like a little desk light for his side, but I don't know. Maybe I'll look at different lighting options. You could do like a overhead one. That's kind of cool. Do like lantern kind of everything's gonna hang pretty low on him though. Mm -hmm. I think I'm still liking the like the lamp the like lamp on the desk kind of vibe. Let's see what he could have. Is there one from Horse Ranch? There is a couple from Horse Ranch. Okay. We could do this tray, which is cute. We could do this lamp. We do this one. I think I like this one. It comes in a blue, like a light blue, which matches upstairs his like. So there you go. His side is also lit up now with the lamp, which is cute. I like it. Okay. And then we also had like a little backpack down there. So we'll put his backpack in next to his thing. Um, Hi, Pebbles. Thank you, Liv, for the bits. Uh, thank you, Allie, for the rose and Chelsea for the marvelous, uh, marvelous, uh, what is it? Marvelous confetti. That's what it is. The marvelous confetti. This is, uh, maybe like where he has been taking notes on stuff. We can sell all these seed packets to get more money too. Um, doing the heiress challenge too because of you on Speak Now playing as John. Oh, fun. I love that. Wow, you're definitely ahead of me, but it doesn't it doesn't take a lot to get ahead of me on these ones since I, I'm not playing like more than on stream. I only stream three times a week. But that's so fun. I love that you're playing it too. Keeping the wallpaper. I, you know what? So far I'm, I'm vibing the wallpaper. I don't know if I'll keep it or not. I haven't decided. I haven't decided. I think I'm gonna keep it, but I'm not like 100% sure. <laughs> Um, because it's so cute and they're still like teen, young teens, you know, I feel like they could add posters and stuff and that'd be kind of cute. Like these kind of guys, you know, they get some collages back here, CDs that he painted or whatever. He likes, oh, little heart photos. That so gives me like Juliet vibes. Make it, make them smaller. They're mini digital. <laughs> photos and then on his side maybe he gets some posters are there any horse related posters some like outdoor stuff this one's kind of cool the outdoor stuff hmm 
Du, du, du. Hmm. Okay, maybe instead I'll do horse ranch. He'll have like one of those horse. This horse is on a plane kind of photo here. <laughs> Somewhere in his room. No, I want like more horse looking things that are more posters or posters. Oh, here we go. He's an outdoorsy kind of guy. So maybe this might be cool. Put that up, the tree stuff. He puts, you know, other other doodads. She's definitely gonna have like this stuff in yellow. Yes, a little makeup on her. Actually, this one's even cuter. I love it. Boom. That's where she took. That's how she took the photos. This is her cameras right there. Um, maybe some used textbooks in the back here. Definitely think like, oh, what's this? Study stacks. Okay. Get her some books back here. And like, what's this craft collection? I don't think she's that crafty. She could have her makeup over here though. I could so, so see her with her little makeup set up. Um, hobby hoard. Hmm. I feel like he might be more. We do a little craft cubby in the back here where he keeps his stuff. Perfect. Okay. Maybe a little like laundry kind of situation over here because they they're teens they're teens that have laundry are you gonna get a horse well our boyfriend has a horse so my thought was like if he moves in you know then we might get like get a horse i'm i'm let me check the requirements of this challenge again okay max charisma and comedy skills Okay, du, 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 three best friends. Social media or entertainment. I think she's gonna be more of like a social media girly. So I wonder if I should get them both laptops, like computers. Don't I have a laptop in the, somewhere in the house? Maybe, I don't remember. Hmm. She needs the friendship bracelet thing. Oh, that'd be cute. Make the friendship bracelets. Super duper friendship bracelet kit. Oh my gosh, so cute. Maybe we'll put it, we'll put it like here or something so we can make it out there. Um, Ryder had an inventory when you divorced him. Dang it, he took the laptop. Of course he took the laptop. That punk. I can't believe he did. I can't believe him. I can't believe he took the laptop. What a jerk. <laughs> That's okay. We can like get them like little iPad laptop things for now, you know? Maybe this one? No. Okay. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Final answer. Oops. And then he can get the little blue one. No. Okay. <gasps> the cow is so cute. Maybe he likes the cow because it's like an animal. But it's not a horse and it's kind of cheesy, I think. Do we just do the black? Yeah, that was cool. All right, so they got, kind of got little laptopy looking things. <laughs> um, and then I was thinking maybe like a little chair here, like a cozy little high school years kind of thing like this. Although I know we have the same one. Maybe like a little chair like this kind of hangout vibe. Or we could do bookshelves. That might be good. A little bookshelf moment. Doing the kits. Book nook kit. So we could do like a bookshelf here. Mm -hmm. I feel like this is more the same color as the room. Yeah. And then we can do stuff on this little shelf. I just feel like she's definitely like a book girly. You know, what's my favorite pack? Bean bag would be cute too. We could definitely put one here. Bean bag is so cute. Well, well, I wish they had bigger. I wish I had more room for them in this house. But I, I kind of like the small house, so I kind of don't want to change it. <gasps> Remy's here. Remy's come to visit. You guys want to see him? Here, let me put my puppy cam on. Hi, Remy. 
Did you come to say hi? Hi, buddy. Here, I'll show you guys on TikTok too. Give me a second. There he is. Hi, Mimi. Hi, sweetheart. How are you? How are you, my baby? Look at the baby. Look at him. He's so smart. Oh, the good boy. Hi, I missed you. Oh, yes. Oh, goodness. We need some pets. This is Remy. This is Chewy's friend. Uh, put her friendship bracelet kit on the shelf. Oh, cute. Yeah, that'd be cute. Oh, my goodness. Look at this baby. Favorite era, Taylor era. Ooh. I mean, I really love Midnight's, and I love Speak Now as an era. It's so fun. I love Purple. And Lover. It's a really good era, too. And Reputation, such a good era. Ah, it's so hard to choose. Okay, Remy. Oh, my goodness. Can we give a treat to Remy? We can give him a treat. You want a treat? Okay. All right, I will allow it. I will allow a couple of treats for Remy. He knows some tricks. I don't know all of his tricks, but I'm learning. Let's do, I don't know, some like teen stuff. Oh, he's leaving. Oh, Chewie's in the door. <laughs> Chewie's like, hello? <laughs> Chewy, come in. Look at Remy sitting there. Okay, we got a treat for you guys. You guys want treats? Come inside. Come on. Come on in. Come here, Chewy. Chewy's coming too. All right, the puppies have arrived. Good boys. Okay, oh, he's doing the boop. Good boy, Remy. That gives you treats. Say thank you. Oh my goodness. That one's from uh, Seriously. Uh, thank you, Seriously, for giving that one. Okay, now it's Chewy's turn. Now it's Chewy's turn, Mimi. Chewy, can you get the boops, please? Can you boop it? Oh, gosh, a good boop. There we go. This one's from Alicia. Yes. Okay, and now Remy's turn. Remy's turn. Can you boop? <laughs> Remy, can you boop? Remy, boop, boop the camera. Boop it. Good boy. They both kind of booped it at once. <laughs> this is from Liz. Say thank you. Oh my God. No, she says thank you. <laughs> so close to camera. And we'll give one more to Chewy for balance. Oh my God. I'm out of these treats now. Gotta order more. Here we go. One for Chewy. Say thank you, Chewy. Yum, yum, yum. Oh my goodness. What good boys. Who is Remy? Remy is a visitor. He's just staying for a little bit. He's a friend's dog. Um, so he's not my dog. Uh, but we're we're loving it. There's Chewy. He's he's getting some cuddles. And then Remy. Remy, did you leave? Remy left. Remy left the building. So now we got Chewy to hang out with. So that's fun. Um, thank you guys for giving treats to the puppo. When are the other episodes getting posted on YouTube? I meant to post them and I ran out of time. So I think I'll probably get to that on Monday. So they'll start coming out this Tuesday, I think, is when the new episodes start coming out. Remy is not a new dog. He's just a visitor. He's just visiting. All right. So let's go back into the game. Big yawn. Here you go, Bubby. Okay. Yes. All right, so we got, okay, let's let's look at like some like, oh, I love the water bottle. She so would be like a water bottle girly. There you go. She's got a lot of little doodads on her desk. Um, okay, let's do, I still love like uh, the high school year stuff. So let's see what other gear we can put. We can put clothes up there, we can put books, like school books up here. That's cute. Maybe like, oh, would she be a cheerleader? Wait, would she be a cheerleader? Hold on. She wears short skirts. I wear, you belong. That is from, is that from Fearless? Yeah, it is on Fearless. Okay, wait. <laughs> she shouldn't be a cheerleader then, right? She should be on the bleachers. Dream about the day. She would be in the bleachers, exactly. She won't be a cheerleader. Um, but that's 
honestly so funny to me. Put some shoes maybe next to it. Or maybe like, I don't know, like a box. I want the clutter, the clutter stuff. Where's the clutter kits? Chewy, don't lick your paws, please. He's like, mom. Here we go. Got some ton of shoes over here. And then we get like some headphones, maybe. Some stuff. I don't know. Maybe we do that instead of this. Do little headphones back here. Give them like a cute color. Yeah, yeah, that one's good. Uh, okay. Let me see what else we got. Oh, some jewelry stuff. Cute. Maybe we'll push these over. And do like the jewelry here. Nah, it looked better like this. Sister just stole some of the room, some of the space. So cute. She's got even more makeup back here. <laughs> no, we don't need that. We don't need that. Okay. Oh, and then like the phones and keys is always such a cute little touch. Okay. Mm. I think it's fine. I think it looks good. I think it's a cute little room for the two. I think it looks great. Boom. We did it. The headphones are from the everyday clutter pack uh, kit, actually. Uh, and I love I love the clutter kits. I think they're awesome sauce. Um, okay. Yeah, I think we're good. All right. Bedrooms have been changed up. Uh, so this one will be, we're going to have her... Assign the bed to Juliet, and then this one will be Steven's. And let's make sure we can, like, she's going to hide her journal under her bed, and he's going to, like, relax up there. I want to see if they can, like, sit up in their rooms. Can you relax up there? Okay, they both can. Perfect. So cute. I didn't actually decorate this side of their room. I wonder if I should throw a little TV on the wall. Oh, my God. I did decorate it when they were children. Oops, didn't do that. All right, I think I might pop like a little TV on the wall over here so they could watch TV from their beds. Ooh. Where is it? There it is. It's like, where is it? There we go. Nice little TV kind of moment here. Well, a part of me wants this one, but it's too big. I think that one's perfect and it's cheaper, so. Give him like a little white kind of thing. There you go. Cool. And that'll be like Steven's TV, mostly. Can he watch TV from here? I want to see if he can watch TV. Or wait, she's going to watch TV. Steven, can you watch TV like that? I think he can. I think he does watch TV from his bed. Yep. That's so cool. I love that. It's perfect. He's just watching his TV from his bed. Hanging. I love it. I love it. Carly, thank you so much for the resub. Sabrina Boo, thank you so much for the resub as well. Omega Thief, thank you so much for the resub. KT Time, thank you so much for the resubs. Ali Me Art, Nightshade, Jemmy Lou, you guys are awesome. Thank you so, so much. And Blasian, thank you so much for the Tiny Diny, the Fire, and the tr Trucker the Turkey on TikTok. Oh, your fearless air just has twins. It's up to you. I feel like normally I go for the one that is like a little older. Like whoever came out first is the heir. But also you can just, I don't know, you could you could do what I also did and make no decision and raise them both as the heir until you get their personalities a little more. Uh, but look at her hanging out with mom. Oh, we should put like a speaker in their room too. It would be cute. But we should like 
auto light all the lights just so that yeah but she's hanging out in her mom's room which is adorable listening to music um okay she wants to have a boyfriend or girlfriend and go on two dates cute and her does she start school tomorrow two days okay she doesn't start school quite yet i believe probably steven's the same oh it looks like juliet and mary just adore spending time together such a comfortable camaraderie among family members is a blessing family dynamics with a close family dynamic family members with a close family dynamic will actively seek each other's company when nearby keep better in touch when they're leaving a separate lie a separate households oh that's so cute i love that they're what is this outfit i forgot that we didn't finish all her outfits oh my gosh that's so funny okay what hold on we're gonna change up her outfits <laughs> we did not finish julia's makeover powdered sugar the house is so cute thank you okay i do love i do love the bonnet but i feel like she would be like kind of rocking maybe like a little i want her to have like a little nightgown kind of vibe in yellow or maybe white oh yeah this one's perfect that one's a good one for her yeah that one's perfect okay so that's her nightgown maybe we'll do like some little slipper shoes like these ones but in like a yellow or something that's cute or these these ones are cute too little little yellow ug kind of looking guys ah. or white ones those are so cute we could do the little floppy bunnies also in a gold i don't know this is hard i don't think we actually need them though okay so here's her every day formal okay we didn't do formal yet obviously we got to pick out a formal dress um I got, it's got to be long dress, the floor length. Hmm. Oh, so cute. She's got to look. I want her to look like Taylor Swift in the, in the music video, when she's like, you know. I want to hold on. Let me look it up. Taylor Swift love story music video. I'm looking up her in her love story outfit because I just love it. Okay. Yeah. It's like a corset with like lace up kind of yellow. Okay. Okay. I don't think I have like anything like that in Sims, but we can try. This is kind of giving something similar for me. This one, because it's kind of got the off the shoulder vibe, which I love. This is also kind of giving it for me. I think, yeah, I mean, it's kind of yellow and it's got like a corset vibe to it. I think I'm going to go with this one though. I think that looks very Juliet to me. Prom is going to be so cute, but we need an updo, like a curly updo. Updo. Okay. I need like a curly-ish, like this kind of vibe, but like higher up. But that's kind of what we're going for, like a very curly updo. <laughs> A la Taylor Swift love story era. I mean, this one's also really cute. Oh my gosh. That one's really cute. I think she had that as a little girl. She had that hairstyle. Let me see. This one maybe kind of looks right. She's brunette. I think that one honestly looks a lot like the one from Love Story. I'm gonna keep looking though. Okay. Let's see if there's like any other curly updos. This one's okay. Hmm. Oh my God, this would be so pretty though. Should I change her hairstyle to be this? <laughs> That's so cute. Ugh. That's so cute. Wait, now I kind of want her to, I want to change all her hairs. <laughs> it's so pretty. Ah. This one's kind of like love story-ish. Mm. Don't forget her hearing aid. Oh, good point, good point, good point, good point. Thank you for reminding me. 
medical wearable. I think she wears this one on the, yeah, there it is. Um, okay. Updo. <gasps> this one's also so pretty. I always love this one. I always, I'm such a sucker for that one. I need an updo though. We need a curly updo vibe here. I think it might be this one. Might be the best one for us. I don't know though, I don't love it. I think I like, I like this one, but I don't love the giant bun on the top. It, it's not quite what I was hoping for. Hmm. Maybe <gasps> this one? That one's better. Okay, that one's good. I think it was this hair is her normal hair. Okay. Cute. Okay, that's kind of close. Then uh, we've got kind of for love story, she's got like a necklace. So we'll do kind of like a, a romantic necklace vibe. Maybe, um, maybe something like that would be good. Or something like this is cute. Let's see what other options. Hmm. This one. This one's kind of cool. This one. Do like in the golden yellow look. Kinda. I am not a big fan of it though. This one's, I think, kind of in the same vein as the one that Taylor's wearing in the music video, but I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like, ooh, maybe this one. This one could be good. Uh, no. I'm gonna go, ooh, this one could be it. No, but it's not as gold. I want it more gold. I think I'm gonna go with this one or maybe with this one. I think that one's okay. What do you guys think? I watched your 100 baby challenge right now. I have watched it so many times that I love it. Oh, thank you. And then we'll do for shoes. We'll do like cutie little shoes or something. Something sweet. Maybe just like a white heel. Hmm, or maybe these ones could be cute. I don't know. It's kind of hard to choose for me. Yeah. Maybe like these ones. I don't know, it's so hard to choose. These ones are cute too with the white sparkles, but I feel like that doesn't give what we're trying to give here. Ooh, these are pretty, they're like clear. That's so cool and they have a little anklet. Mm. Let's go with maybe these or like the plain white kind of pump look. You gotta check her hair color. Well, it's kind of hard. I think it's the same. I went, I got, I got it back to the same one. Um, but we also, I wanted to change it to the curly, the curly hair one. Where is it? Where are you curly hair? No, I can't find it, hold on. All right, I'm gonna find it. Oh, she could also do something like this. That one's also really pretty. Uh, here it is, Sims Trouble. Boom. <gasps> yeah, oh my gosh, she's so cute. Okay, I love that. And there's her like up, updo kind of look. Her, we're doing our best with uh are you not uploading to youtube anymore yeah i upload to youtube i uploaded yesterday mm. i'm just not in love with the dress i want to be in love i want it to be like a princess little look here i want the corset vibes maybe this is this like better not really though. The top is better, but the bottom is not. That's so wedding dressy. I mean, there's this, right? But I just feel like that's too much for right now. 
do this one. We could do one of these ones. You know what? I think these ones actually look the best. Let's do, is there like a yellowish version? Just no shoes. Hmm. Yeah, I think the poofier one, obviously. I think this one looks good. I think that's giving the best one. Or a ball gown. Ooh, yeah. Maybe we CC shop for the right dress. We could also do that later. But I feel like this is kind of the move, you know? It's kind of, it's, I love this dress. I use it so many challenges, but it's just so cute. I think this looks good. And then I wonder if there's like a little headband or something. A little hat kind of vibe. So I think there's like a cute little, I have this little headband, but I also have like a pearl one. Or we do a crown. Boom. It's over the top. But I think there is, I thought there was like a cute little pearl headband. Is that just... Was that just like for kids? Maybe I just had the pearl headband for kids. Oh, no, here it is. Oh, it almost fits. And nah. it does kind of fit, but I think that this is perfect. I don't love the necklace with it anymore, but it is what it is. Let's change that really quick. Necklaces. Maybe we'll just do kind of like this. Or we could just do, oh, like a little simple one. That one's pretty. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect, Juliet. Okay. Ah. For her workout clothes. I mean, we obviously need yellow. Oh, that one's really cute. That'd be a cute everyday Juliet outfit as well. Let's do a top, though. A little little yellow top and bottom moment here colors yellow uh -huh. like that or maybe like that oh her medical wearables not on here i kind of wish that it would just be on every outfit but it's fine okay maybe that and some pants Colors, yellow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hmm. Oh my god, we can do a little cheer skirt. I mean, she's not. She's in the bleachers though. Waiting for one day when you look up and find that what you're looking for. I mean, should she have glasses? That would be kind of cute. Why does everything have to be yellow? Because I want it to be. It's the fearless era. So we're like going for gold. It's like kind of the color of the era. And I like I like to continue with the theme. So I'm going for gold slash yellow for her full full fit. Um I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go here. Yeah. I wanna do some some cute little yellow tennis shoes as well. Yeah, cute. It's cute. Cheer skirt with the with the top. Mm. But she's not a cheerleader. You could do round glasses, right? Like I think that'd be cute. I think she'd be cute in glasses. Wait. Let me see. Although can we can we have glasses with the the medical wearable? I don't know. Yeah, you can. <gasps> oh, she's so cute. <laughs> Now she looks even more like Belle. She looks even more like Belle than she did before. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, she's so cute. I think she, I like the glasses, but I think for the dress, we're gonna keep her without the glasses. This is so cute. <laughs> Where's Chewy? He's in his bed. We can just adjust, there he is. She does look a lot like Belle. Wait, maybe we should do white for the bottoms here. There you go. A little, little moment there. All right, sleepy wear. We already have that. She's looking cute. We'll put her glasses on and her medical wearable. Her hearing aid and her glasses. Cute. <laughs> 
All right, party look. Obviously we need the... Okay, and then we need glasses. All right, party wear. I feel like, again, she'd be like a dress kind of girly. Like just wearing really cute little, little dresses. <gasps> this one's so cute. I'm gonna be like this one. This one's really cute on her. With the cowgirl boots, maybe. Where'd those little yellow ones go? Yes, girl, cute! A big t-shirt for sleepwear. Oh, good point. Okay, maybe I'll do two. I'll do two. I'll do an oversized t-shirt as well for sleepwear. Let me find, whoops. I wanna find the like you belong with me fit. Like is she wearing, like what is she wearing with it? With the Junior Jewels shirt. Like is it pajama pants? Like what does she wear with it? Just jeans? I think it's like plaid. I think it's like plaid pajama pants. I can't find a photo of it, but I like it. Okay, we're gonna do a baggy shirt. Like a baggy t-shirt that looks like written on. I don't know if we have one of those, but we're gonna do our best. I know I have baggy shirts in the male, in the men's wardrobe. Maybe we take away feminine and sleep and we just do like t-shirts mm -hmm. I know I have some custom content male t-shirts that are like baggy oh wait this one's kind of baggy too well, the junior jewels is like a t-shirt t-shirt so like you I stayed away here let's go to tops I'm gonna go to custom content. I'm like, where's my boy cozy t-shirts? Where are they? Cozy boy shirts. They're like tucked. They're like this, but not a sweatshirt. Where are they? I'm so confused. I use them all the time for my male sims. And yeah, I cannot find it. I must be passing it every single time. And you guys will probably be like, Kelsey, it's right there. And I'm, I'm just missing it. I'm missing it. Under full body, the giant hoodie. I'm not gonna do the giant hoodie. I'm not looking for that one. Um, okay, it's under, mm, oh. We're gonna do fashion shirts masculine and we'll narrow it down here. Is it just not here? Like why are there no, where are the t-shirts? I swear I'd be able to find it if it was him. He's wearing it. This is the shirt I'm looking for. He's wearing it for pajamas. What the heck? Why can't I find that shirt? I'm so annoyed. Where's the shirt? Where is it? Okay, hold on. If we do yellow, it'll show up. Because it was a yellow one. Uh, that is so weird. It just does not show up. For feminine frames. That's such a bummer. Why would they do that? I was like, oh, I was just gonna do Steven's shirt. Masculine. <laughs> that is wild to me that it's not listed. Well, bummer. That's fine. We're just gonna do t-shirts then. I'm so sad, but it's fine. If you do something like this, the Moschino, Moschino. I mean, that's not too bad. 
It's giving me what I was thinking it would give. This one's also good. I'm mad. I'm mad I can't use that shirt. That's okay though. This is fine. And then we'll put the little, yeah. the little, um, these guys in the plaid, in the blue. Yeah, like that. <laughs> Perfect. This'll work. I know, I was like, that's a t-shirt. Why, why, it's so unisex, I don't understand. There's our other one, but I love this. Cute. Okay, party wear, cute. Swimwear. Uh, we gotta get somewhere going. I think like this is cute. That's giving like, giving for me. Yeah, love it. That's so cute. And then for hot weather, give her her wearable again. Oh, and probably her glasses as well. Okay, hot weather. We do something like this, which is cute. Or maybe something like this, a little tea. Oh, that's cute. Let's do that. And then we'll do like maybe something like this. And then some shoes. Call it a day, looking good. And then for cold weather, I mean, I think that, mm, cold weather, color yellow, fashion choice, feminine. I mean, how often is she gonna be cold, you know? Oh, this is cute. Maybe wear some jeans underneath. I like the flares. Maybe we'll do some flared jeans. Hmm. Or like wide leg. These ones are good. These ones like wide leg. These are also cute, but I don't like the belt hanging down. Here we go. These are good. Oh, we can also make them a light color. That's cute. And let's give her a little her little boots. I love her little cowgirl boots that are being, that are yellow. So cute. We'll do her hearing aid. Okay, and then I think that kind of work. Oh, it's clipping. The boots are clipping a bit. Sad. So so sad. Let me see if there's another pair. Like yellow kind of. Shoes that'll work. I mean, these are cute. Mm, maybe these. I mean, like, how much do I even care about the clipping, you know? A, a lot. A lot more than I thought I would. Okay. Maybe these. Maybe these ones? These are cute. Little flowers on them. <gasps> Look who's here! It's Remy. Hi, Remy. Hey, thank you. Oh my goodness, Remy's here. She we has left the building. This is Juliet. She's so cute. Yes, that's Juliet. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, we got we got full puppy vibes right now. We got puppy energy. There we go. This is Remy. If you guys haven't met him yet, here we'll put we'll put him on too. Oh, He's, he might be piecing out. You leaving, Remy? Hey, yo. Uh, okay. Back to our gameplay here. Uh, okay. I like this fit. This is cute. I love it. I didn't give her makeup in any of these other ones, so maybe I'll give her a little bit of, bit of something here. I always will do like 
really cute makeup in the first round and then like completely forget every other <laughs> every other day it's like she's in a hot day that's a little yeah this one you gotta have some blush on here too oh Rimmy's in Chewie's bed and he's so he's too big for it it's so cute okay we're gonna do some blush and then some lip for this as well. Perfect. Little princess vibes. Her athletic, no makeup, no makeup. Party wear and makeup. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wait, this is so cute. Wait, I could have done that. Oh my gosh. Wait, we could have done this for her. Okay, hold on. Oh, the phone. Her formal hair could have been that one. Where is it? Sims Trouble. That's so much better. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, perfection. Hello, perfection. I love it. I mean, we could still do that for party wear too, honestly. It's cute. Actually, we should do that for the hot weather look. Hot weather, we should do like the hair up. Cute, <laughs> so cute. Yeah, my Christmas tree is still up. I think I might take it down today though. We'll see how, how I do. But anyway, makeup time. I also need her in like a gold dress. So stand by for that. Obviously. The hypocrite. Okay. Cute. Okay. Oh, maybe we should do a little hair up for this one, too. There you go. She put her little hair up in a bun. We're swimming. So cute. She's such a cute sim. Okay. So for this, I also want another look that's like gold. There's like a gold sparkly dress. I know. Where is it? It's like a short dress. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's just not yellow. Considered yellow. Wait, this one's also kind of gold, but that's not the one I'm looking for. Oh, this one's cute too. It also comes in like a yellow. Ugh, so cute. But that's not also also not what I'm looking for. Where is it? This one. Like, come on. That's fearless for sure. Giving fearless. Someone tell me why. Let's do some gold heels. Be like these ones in gold. Yeah, cute. So cute. Uh, we got a couple. You're doing amazing, sweeties. Just Kate, you're doing amazing, sweetie. Thank you so much for tuning in and thank you for your patience while I got to you. And Anna Mia, you're doing amazing, sweetie. Thanks for tuning in. And Kids Mistress, thank you so much for the resub. Solomon Pruitt, thank you so much for the resub as well here for the Sims 4. Thank you so much for the resub. Rexy, thank you so much for the sub. Uh, Kakazir, thank you so much. And Sil Sil Noe, Harley, Sabrina Boo. You guys are rock stars. Daisy Rose, thank you so much for the live fest. Uh, Eva, thank you so much for the rose. And Lorana Taylor, thank you for the rose. The 20 roses. Oh my gosh. Oh, didn't notice all the roses. I feel like we could also do kind of something like, ooh, like she did her hair a little different, you know? We have this one. But like, I don't know. I feel like I can't tell. Oh, there's this one too. Wait, that's the one we already had. <laughs> I meant like this one. This is cute too. I could totally see her rocking this or maybe this little slicked version of it. Let's do this one for the, but she's got the little bangs. It's like, where did she put her bangs? You know? Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm overthinking it, but in my brain, I'm like, well, where would the bangs go? I think this is cute. Let's take the necklace off. Necklace off. 
But look how cute she is. It's so fearless. Ah, I feel like that should be her. I don't know which one I would do for her, like, prom. Hopefully we get to go to prom more than once, but I don't know. We might not. But our girl is, is all, all done. Julia Eras is here, and she's looking adorable. I might even give her, like, a second little outfit for fun. Maybe this one. This one also feels very, like... Oh, yeah. That's, like, gold. It's so cute. I wish I had a fringy dress for her to wear, you know? Like, something with tassels. I just feel like she's a tassel girly, and she deserves the world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do something like this with that little dress here. We could do little tennis shoe moment maybe oh, these ones are cute too let's do a little tennis shoe a little sneaker sneaker Hello. moment here the little yeah cute that's cute Mwah. uh and then let's get her some socks oh these ones are so cute maybe these ones hmm yeah, we'll just give her some normal socks then. Perfect. Or, oh, this one. Oh, so cute. We could do them in the yellow as well. I like the white. Perfect. She's so cute. Okay, Juliet is done. Officially. Makeover completed. Yeah, I haven't watched you since 100 Babies. I need to go back and see what I missed. Yeah, short lifespan will probably be one prom. You're right. What are her traits? Great question. Oh my gosh, look at her little pajamas. Her her traits are self-assured, creative, creatively gifted, high self-esteem, and alluring. And Steven is a horse lover, outgoing, has a top-notch infant, high self-esteem, socially gifted, and high metabolism. So there you have it for them. Mary is, of course, like ambitious, romantic, an art lover, a cat lover. Which, poor girl. I feel like she deserves another cat. Oh my gosh. Let's uh, replace that. Let's turn off the music and go to sleep. Oh my gosh. No, Riders, both of them are Mary's side. Okay. Right side is also Mary's side. There's no side for Ryder. Okay, well, apparently Ryder still has a side of the bed. Awkward. It's all good. Who's calling? Hey, sweetie, we're coming over to see the little one and help out however we can. No, you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. There's no little one to take care of. What do you mean? Oh, my gosh. Look at their room. It's so cute. I love it. I love their little room. It's rebate day. I should have done the room makeover today. Jeez. Oh, you know what? I'm glad we changed her pajamas because her pajamas would have been literally the same as her mom's. Which is fine, but it would have been kind of funny because I'm like, wait, that was Mary's pajamas. Bro, do we have a funeral? Wait, what do you mean? No. Uh, small reptile, thank you so much for six months. Oh, for Mayor Whiskers. No, we didn't have a funeral for Mayor Whiskers. It all happened so fast and it was at the end of an episode. So we did not. Let's maybe cook everybody breakfast. We're going to cook everybody breakfast, 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 eggs and toast. I also need to remove some of this Christmas stuff. Perfect. Okay. All done. I know there was so much <laughs> to do. Mary is such a good mama. She is a good mama. We're cooking up a storm for the kiddos. They sleep in, of course they do. Oh, look who woke up. It was Steven first. Steven woke up. He's hungry. Don't go eat that. Your mom is making breakfast. And Mary, oh. I read about you in the news every day, Ms. Eras, and try to live my life just like you. Well, she is famous, so. Juliet's like, I'm gonna join the cooking. Oh, look at the, oh my God. I love that they have almost very similar sweatpants. <laughs> It's cute. Don't have, don't do that. Mary is cooking. You're not eating that. Put that away, sir. Okay, I know you're all hungry. 
but none of that. Stop trying to eat that. Your mom is almost done. Just sit down and watch TV. Your mom is almost done cooking. Juliet's gonna take a shower. She's like, I'm gonna take my shower really quick. Mom is cooking up a storm. I love that these two girls are in their curly hair era. Curly hair era. And Steven's kind of got his longer, straighter hair from his dad. Ooh, teardrops just got some money. Okay, let's call everyone to the meal. Be like, everybody, come get some food. Eat your eggs and toast. Steven's like, okay, I can go eat my eggs and toast. And Juliet's coming out as well. In her adorable little outfit. I love the boots. So good. Is it Drew O'Clock? It should be Drew O'Clock. Should we invite him over? Be like, hello. Oh. Hello, sir. Would you like to move in with us? I'm currently doing the Olivia Rodrigo oh, Sour Legacy Challenge. Ooh. I didn't even know there was one. That's so cool. Um, I miss some. Where did her husband go? Oh my gosh, they divorced. You should catch up and watch those episodes because they're so funny. That one's already live, I believe, on the on my uh, channel. The one where they divorced, I think. I might be wrong about that one. All right, why don't you clean up? Oh, your mom already cleaned up for you. Cool, 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 cool. Why don't you go brush your teeth? She's feeling very playful. So her requirements, what do we need to get started for her? She needs to have three best friends, experience at least two significant breakups, and max charisma and comedy. So we can work on her charisma skill, practice speech. But we also need to look at your guys' sims for her. So hopefully you guys uploaded some to the gallery. Um, oh my gosh, also we need to clean this at some point. Clean that. But we're working on her charisma skill. I think it's like level one, yeah. Writers like congratulations on your recent birthday. Thanks, Dad. Okay, let's see. Because hmm. we also need to like manage the, the high school and stuff. So maybe we will go, we'll save here and I'm gonna go look at your guys's Sims. The homework book on the table is bugging me. Oh, I'm sorry, Emily. I like, I like a little clutter in the house. Although I guess it is like children's book. So Mary's gonna keep that. She's like, oh, memories. All right, let's save and go to manage worlds. Mary should have a new baby with Drew when the teens move out. Oh, that'd be kind of cute. Wait, I didn't put a new cat up, Kelsey. Okay, well, I'm opening it now. So you gotta, gotta hurry. Use the hashtag Kelsey Eras. Okay, we're gonna look up Kelsey Eras first, and then we'll look up Kelsey Eras challenge. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Look at these cuties. Oh my gosh, you guys made so many good sins. Look at her. Fearless BFF, she's so cute. Kaylee Garner, thank you so much, Kaylee. Darby lives the um, to be the life of the party. She loves going out with her friends. It is the best wing woman you'll ever meet. Helping a certain someone fulfill their serial romantic aspiration is right up her alley. The CC is just hair and makeup. If I remember right, I downloaded them from your list, so you should hopefully have them. Oh my gosh, perfect. Let's put her in the world. Thank you so much, Darby. I love it. Okay, so she, Darby's gonna live maybe in Copperdale? Cause that's where we're gonna go to high school anyway. So we're gonna move her in oh, with the munch. That's so random. We've got a lot of cats. Okay. Maybe Martinez. All my Sims like just keep moving around here. Um, I feel guilty putting her into an empty lot, but it is what it is. <laughs> well, what if I want to visit her? Maybe I'll just kick someone out of their home. Not that one. Not that one. That one. I'm gonna evict them. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm gonna, I gotta put free real estate on. Free real estate on. All right, we're gonna move, her. we're gonna evict them. Thank you. All right, she lives in that big house. <laughs> oh no, her hair. Her hair is gone. Okay, let me quickly has full edit mode on. Let me quickly give her some hair back. <laughs> I'm going to do the not so berry challenge again as well. Oh my gosh, how cute. 
I love it. Okay. Let's give her her hair back. I gotta remind myself what her hair looked like. Oh my god, this sim is also really cute. Okay, her hair was... Oh my god, Jonathan Anderson. Who is that? Romeo Johnson. Ah, we got spent some Romeos. Okay, well, I'm not finding her randomly. She, she's just, yeah, she's not there anymore. That's so annoying. I think it was like half up, half down vibes. So we'll go for that. I swear I had that hairstyle at one point too. So I'm like, that's weird that I don't, that like it didn't stay. So I felt like I had that. Okay, no, it's not the style that she had or the color. Let me see if I can find. Wait, was that the color of her hair? Was it dark? I didn't realize. Maybe it was that color. Okay. Regardless. Wait, her brows are like this color though. I wish I could check on here, but it won't let me. Sad. Does it count when someone downloaded? Okay. Well, her eyebrows are brown, so I'm gonna go brown with it. I'm gonna, mm. she had dark brown. Okay, that's what I thought. So we'll go here. Her brows, we'll have it match the hair. There you go. All right, dark brown it is, perfect. And it was like a half up, half down kind of look. Um, like this kind of. I mean, it's. I know that's not custom content, but it looks good. <laughs> Or something like this. That one's cute, but it's not my favorite. It'd be like this one? No. Uh, hmm. I'm sorry. I'm like so diligent. I love looking at all the different hair colors. It could be okay. Like that one's pretty. She could do one of these ones. This one's really cute. Oh, this one. This is the one I was like, this one looks like a lot like the one that she had on. This literally looks like the same. I don't know why, but this looks the same as what she had on before. So hopefully we're not missing anything else. Nope. Perfect. She's perfect. She's so cute. Check. Good job. I love her. My CC list is on my Patreon, so you can go to patreon.com slash Kelsey Dangerous. Uh, and, and it's free on there, so you don't have to pay or join my Patreon um, unless you wanted to. All right, let's check it out. Let's do it. Okay. All these Sims are so cute. Oh my gosh, he's so handsome. Romeo Rose. He's got, I think he's so freckles. Romeo grew up and not... I'm um, not certain his love life would succeed, but the moment he laid eyes on Juliet, he knew they had a future together. I love it. Like, part of me is like, do they just, are they siblings? Like, I'm gonna put them there. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys are so cute. Future man, wink. That one was from, who was that from? Sunflower, thank you, Sunflower. Oh my gosh, I love this one too. She's so cute. Arnie Wheeler. Uh, Annie. Annie Wheeler is a smarty pants who wants to be a writer. She's a very logical person who strives for perfection in most things. When she writes, she can finally let herself be creative. Annie is a lesbian who gets some pregnant, but for your sim to be teen besties with. Aw, I love her. I'm going to put her somewhere too. Maybe she's going to move in with a fam. Let's move her in with the Harjo fam. Cutie. Okay, let's hope that her hair's still there. Her hair is not there. None of her outfit is there. R.I.P. Arnie, no, Arnie, no, <laughs> poor Arnie. Let me double check what her stuff looks like. I'm trying to memorize. Okay, so she had like a fun little updo. Of course, this is such good CC. And she had like a cute little black dress and a necklace and some hoops. Okay, I'm gonna try to recreate that as best I can with my own custom content. Swaby. 
The cat is up. I see you guys. I have noticed. Sunflower was here, I think. Oh, oh, that's great. I love that. Okay, let's get some of her hair back. So she had a cute updo with like some really cute edges. I unfortunately don't know if I have that, but we can try. Is that, does she have blue eyes? I don't know if she, yeah, she does. So pretty. What a pretty sim. And her CC was really pretty. Okay. Um. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. A little, little updo moment. I mean, why does she look so different to me when I did it? Am I missing something? Is it her eye makeup? I don't think so. I don't think so. I think it's just the hair. It's super different. Oh, oh, that might be close. It's got edges. It's not quite the same, but it looks cute. <laughs> I wish I had your hair, but. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go with this one. That one's cute. Okay, let's give her, let's give Annie a little dress, a little black dress. Colors black. She had a cute little black short dress on. Let's see which options I've got. I mean, there's this one, it's just kind of cute. It was strapless, kind of like this vibe almost, but like obviously cuter than that. Um. <laughs> That is not it at all. Bum, bum, bum. Ah, I think I might go. Not that. Hmm. I might go with like one of the first mm. ones I tried. I feel like there's another. Like this one's cute too, or this one. Hmm. Let me let me even just do just my custom content dresses. Like this one's cute. And also in black, I think that suits her pretty well. I feel like this one is cute and really suits, I think. This one's really cute. And I'm gonna go for this one's also cute. Might go with this one. I think it looks fun. And then we can do her little necklace too. Necklaces. I think she had like silver kind of like, and it was layered. It was like a layered silver. Although that one's really cute with a little. Huh. Uh, but I think it was like a layered silver necklace kind of like this. No, like this one. Boom. There you go. That was pretty good. It was okay. I did okay. Ah, her formal hair is gone. No, uh, no. Okay, let me think. Hmm, I mean, this one's really cute. Hmm, this one's cute. I think that's close to what we have. Let me see. This one's really cute. It's a little updo moment. Mm, the braids are always so pretty. This is pretty on her. Little top knot moment. I think I'm just gonna do the same hair that I did for um, for her everyday look. Although this one's so pretty. Uh, but I think I'll just do the like cute little updo that she has. Where is it? This one. She's just gonna have, oh no! You were so, I bet you had so many cute hairs for her and I'm like, eh. Uh. There she is. Party, ah. <laughs> I'm like, no. Content, custom content. I mean, that's really cute. Oh no, her outfit's not there either. No. Oh wait, this one's nice too. I like that one. Oh God. 
Half her outfits are gone. <laughs> I hate when this happens and I'm like, I got your sim and she was so cute. And then I wrecked it. I wrecked it. We're gonna go with that um, for her party wear. We're gonna go with like a cute little, is this like a purple fit, blue fit? This looks kind of like a blue fit. Let's do this blue dress. Swimwear looks perfect. Actually, the makeup is so fun. Nice, okay. Okay, hot weather. Oh, this got randomized for sure. Or maybe it didn't, maybe she just likes sunscreen. I like, kinda like this idea of her with the braids. I like the pigtails, see that? And cold weather is just nothing. Nothing for the cold weather, how dare. All right, we're gonna do that. And we're gonna do a cute little full body cold weather action. Wait, what's this? Have I always had this? Um, excuse me, this is so cute. I wish it came in purple because fearless, ah, fearless. Anyway, um, I'm gonna do a normal cozy like little jacket moment for her. Maybe this one. Cute, I think, I don't know. I don't know, but I did my best. <laughs> That's okay, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm the one that, that used my, uh, like, you know, chose your sim and then goofed it. Okay, perfect, all right. Ooh, there's so many other cuties. Look at Aaron Brinkley, of my friend, or maybe more for Julia, Juliet. I don't, I, I don't have a really have a story for them. I just want to share with you. Oh, I love it though. He's a cutie. Let's pop him in here. He'll be with Romeo here over in this in this place. The boys just get a field together. Oh no, his hair is all gone. Ah, this is so, this is so. I hate when this happens. Ah. A big fan. Hi, Avery. <sighs> I download the cutest Sims in them. I just have to go and like fix them all. Oops. <laughs> all the lovers are bald. I love it. I'm sorry. I have to change all your beautiful creations here. I will do my best to keep them accurate. I only caught your live stream. What's up, Pika? Here we go. Okay, let's see what yours. Oh my gosh, these Sims are so pretty too. Sarah M, your Sims are so cute. Like Jeanette Grove is so cute. I kind of want to download her too. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put her in here with us. Look how cute she is. I'm just gonna, you know what? I'm just gonna add people to this and then do them all together. There you have it. Marissa Shepard. This is all for, also from Sarah M. Um, we got a lot from Sarah M over here. So thank you, Sarah M. Black Dahlia, oh my gosh, look how cute Dory is. Dory is a shy, gentle, non-binary person that loves playing video games. They don't often make friends, but there's something about Juliet that made Dory feel com comfortable. They start to come out of their shell and realize there's something bright and golden about Juliet, but they just love her as a friend or maybe something more is yet to be seen. All for my master list, bless. We're gonna add Dory, they are so cool. I could never make a sim this cool. I love Dory with all of them. No Prince Charming. I know this is also from Black Dahlia, but I think this is so cool. Far from a Romeo, Misha loves alternate alternative rock and challenging authority. He plays the rebel in everything he does, but hides his intellect behind a computer screen. He loves to program and causes havoc online, often taking payment for cha charging some B's and A, changing some B's to A's, but bad influence all around. And yet there's something about a bad boy that makes the heart flutter. Oh my God, how fun. I gotta, I gotta add this Sims too. That's such a fun story. This is, <laughs> your Sims are so cool. I love seeing all of your guys' Sims. These are all great. Oh my God, I love them all. Thank you guys so for submitting so many. I'm going to also look, oh my gosh, Snooty. This one's cute, Abigail Woods, what a cutie. I'm gonna I'm gonna also do the Eris challenge because I also said that hashtag and I didn't wanna like not see some of them. No, it's about the same Sims. Okay, sick. I love it. Okay, cuties patooties. Honestly, Cammy, so cute. I love the butterfly tats. Okay. 
But I think this is enough of our Sims. Let's get Aaron uh, his hair. Okay, ooh. I feel like I have hair just like that. It's like kind of black and swoopy. I swear I have that hair. So we're, I think we're gonna be good. Also, I love his earrings. Love. Okay, custom content hair, please. Da, 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 da. Like, I swear, I have like kind of the same hair. Isn't that the same? Kind of. I think the part is in a different location. Maybe this one? Let me see which one's better more. I think it looks like the same. This one looks the same. We just gotta get this man some pants. Poor Aaron has no pants. <laughs> Sarah, you made so many awesome sims. Thank you so much for sharing them with me. Let's do some. Returning back. I'm just gonna give him some jeans. Mm, maybe like these ones. These are kind of cool. Some like denim, ripped denim jeans that he'll have some cool like tennis shoes. Not those, those are not that great. Let's get him some good ones. Yeah, like these ones. Perfect. All right, hopefully he has the rest of his clothes okay. Nope. <laughs> his dad is cool though. He's a cool, he's a good looking guy. Good looking Sim here. Hmm. I could do something saucy. Ooh. Uh, he said ooh. He likes it. Uh, let's put him in. This is hard. What are these from? This one looks cool to me. This looks like a cool guy. But it's also kind of messy. You know what? I'm just going to be boring and I'm going to give him like a cool little outfit there. That looks great. Sleepwear looks great. Party wear looks great to me. <laughs> Sorry, no. I will. I will give him a shirt. But like, maybe they didn't want him to have a shirt. That's all I'm saying. You know, maybe the point is that he's not supposed to have a shirt. Swimmer is perfect. Hot weather is perfect. Cold weather is perfect. I'm just kidding. I want to give him pants. I'll give him pants. Okay. Let's see. Don't say I never did anything for you. I gave this man pants. Oh, okay. Uh, I want like, I want like pants, like the slacks, you know? Yeah, like these, these look good. And, like some black ones and like some nice boots. He's got some boots. Um, Yeah, like the kind of boot maybe or like, I feel like he he can have some fancy boot. Why do these feel like the same boot? I don't know, but these look good. It looks good. Erin looks great. Let's double check Jeanette, but I think she looks pretty good. Oh, okay, sucker. She'll do like that kind of vibe maybe. She looks cute. Perfect. Sleepy wear, oh, that's so cute. Party wear. Adorable, we're just missing some shoes. We could do like these in the white. Cute. Or we could do some of my CC shoes. Like these ones. Cute, yeah. Swimwear. We need her in a swimwear moment. I'm gonna maybe give her some of my best work here. Do like this one. I feel like this one in the black will look so cute. Or in the white even Ooh. looks great on her. Or this one, honestly, in like the black and white. There we go. I think that looks good together. All right, hot weather. She just needs some sh some little shorties. I'll give her some just classic little denim short moment, maybe. Not that one. There's the other ones that I like. These ones, perfect. Put them in the denim. Give her some shoes. Hmm. Maybe some like. Hmm. Ooh, these ones are cute, the little clogs. I like it. And then cold weather. Ooh, she's almost, she's almost there. We just gotta save her from being pantless in the cold. Mm. Give her like some cute little shoes. I bet I have some really cute cold weathery shoes. Or maybe like these ones. She seems like a fun, stylish girl, you know? So I want to give her some fun, stylish little shoes. Be like, mm, maybe these ones? No. 
She seems to like the color green though, and I love that. Maybe these ones? Oh, those are cute. They're not green, so. Let me do these ones, but in green. Oh, girl, love that. Okay, I think and everybody else should be good. Yay! Thank you guys. It'd be cute if the high school sweetheart she needs to have a baby with is him. He wants a soulmate. He'd be willing to wait for her to complete the aspiration or date around. That's really romantic. I love that. We'll see who she connects with. I kind of want to see who she crushes on. Uh, but I definitely think the bad boy would be good to like break her up with someone. <laughs> uh, okay. But let's go back to our girl and then we'll we'll kind of put all of those teens into high school with us. Quick question. When will you be doing new year, new builds? You promise not trying to rush you. I want a timeline of what to expect. I don't know. Uh, I've been thinking about it. And honestly, I do want a new build for the 100 baby challenge, but our 100 infant challenge, but I also just haven't had the passion for it. Like I haven't like come up and like, oh, I can't wait to do this. Every time I think about it, I get anxious. So I, I wonder if maybe it would be fun if any of you guys wanted to um, build a, a new 100 infant house for me and upload it to gallery using Kelsey 100 infant. Um, you can do that. I might do it off line. I haven't decided. I really haven't decided. So, but we're going to do some high school students. So we're going to add the students here. Arnie, Aaron, we'll do Dory. They're looking so cool. Obviously, Juliet, Jeanette, uh, Misha, Romeo, Steven. Okay, we can add even more now. But all the Sims that I downloaded with you guys. This Karen looks cool. Karen Caliente looks cool. We got do, 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 baby Ariel. Could be kind of fun. She's like a celeb. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't love all the townies that we got. Leyland Rhodes looks cool. Martina looks cute. I think that's fine. That's a good amount of students. And then I can I can do the high school student. So class one will be uh, Juliet. We'll do. Wait, where's Romeo? Oh, there he is. Juliet Romeo. We'll do um, Arnie and Jean Jeanette. Honestly, oh, wait, hold on me. Part of me thinks that we should just download even more of the, the Sims so that I can have all of your guys' Sims. Because I would rather have them than like the other ones. So I'm going to go manage worlds and I'm going to go download more of your guys' Sims. How do you choose who goes to school? It's a mod that I have um, that I downloaded and I love it. It's so good. Okay, let's grab more of your guys' Sims. Uh, na, 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 na. I know someone was really excited for hello eras. So really excited for their sim. Okay, here is the fearless BFF. There's more of them down here for some reason. I haven't been able to reach them. So great. We got Kaylee Gardner. Thank you so much for making our, some of our sims here. We got, uh, here we go. Abigail Woods. I know one of you was really excited for Abigail to join the fray. So let's have her join. I'm going to, I'm going to put her in San Sequoia. Maybe we'll have some empty lots. Yeah. Perfect. All right. She, yeah, she's of course, of course she doesn't have any clothes. <laughs> Poor Abigail. Yum. The fearless BFF was an adult. Oh, one of them was an adult? Okay. Well, keep an eye out. Also, that's her little... What's going on with her lashes here? Oh, she's got a couple rings on. Apologies, I'm going to remove her rings. They're very cute, though. Um, Let me double check what Abigail's shirt was. Okay, it's cute. I feel like I have that CC, but like different. Same, but different, you know what I mean? Okay, let's do like a little sweatshirt. I mean, this one kind of matches the vibe. She had like kind of a layered thing going on, which I feel like I have one of those from the pack, from like the high school years pack. Hold on, let me find that. Tons, no packs, high school years. Yeah, this one. 
this this kind of thing or this one that one looks kind of similar I like this kind of I don't know I'm sorry if I'm butchering your your vision here but I think these are cute for her I like the purple with it that one's cute to me I think this one matches more of the size of the type of pant or maybe even this one looks cute with it or this one even with those little shorts though it's kind of hard I think I'm gonna go with this Hmm, it's all clipping. Ugh. This one doesn't clip, so I might go with this one. What a cutie patootie. She's so pretty. I am going to remove all her rings, I'm sorry. Oh my god, this fit is everything to me. Love that fit. Cute. What a cutie, okay, great. Abigail's looking good. Okay, we can add in. Dun, 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 Let's see. Any other friends? There's another Romeo here. Romeo Knight. Oh, a sweet guy who has spent many classes staring at the most beautiful Sim that is truly, utterly enamored. When Romeo sees wow. Juliet across the cafeteria, he decides he wants to have the best the best day by making a bold move and telling Juliet, you belong with me. Ner <laughs> this is so cute. Nerves racing in the face of a sim so beautiful he can barely breathe. Could Romeo be the forever and always in Juliet's love story? And we're all playing Fizzle out and they um, after they graduate. I love it. We're gonna add Romeo at night. I love that little sassy bit. It's so good. Okay. Let's see who else we can add. Marissa Shepard is so cute. We're so adding her. Oh, what? Where's all that stuff? I swear I had all of it. Marissa's neighbor's child. Okay, no, I did not have any of that. That is for sure. Sarah M, I might actually delete this sim just because I don't have any of that stuff. Um, but I and I have a lot of your other sims uh, that you that you've graciously included in the group. So it's all good. There's so many Romeos. I love it. <laughs> So many Romeos. He 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 he. We got Juliet's secret crush, Brent Foster. Come on, Brent. Handsome guy. Look at that. Handsome guy. More naked sims. I know. I know you guys are also naked. Wait, he's a young adult. We gotta make them teens. Gotta make them teens. Hi, there's another friend for Juliet here. She's so cute, Jacqueline. She's a kindred spirit. She's so cute, I love her. I wanna read her little just description because I missed it. Jacqueline has always loved going out on the town and living life to the fullest. She is a kindred, she finds a kindred spirit when she meets Juliet, makes sure to drag her new friend along for all the party scenes. Together they enjoy playing their music and scouting for cuties. Ah, I love it. So many cuties. Okay, we got that one. Sunflower, we got this one. Camille, she's just so cute, but I know I don't have any of that stuff. Maria, Romeo Wilson. So many Romeos, I love it though. Romeo Smith. <laughs> we got Celine Gomez, fearless love interest. Oh, there's so many good ones. Oh my gosh, Governor Whiskers, <laughs> Governor Mittens. Kelsey, we have the cat. Okay, we will download Governor Mittens as well very soon. Ooh, this one's cute. Chantel, um, tell once sing ever since she went to a concert when she was little, but she's always been a very shy uh, person. She constantly tries to talk to people when she goes out, but can't bring herself to. She was encouraged by her last name being Song. So when she was younger, she used to take walks out the woods, car carving drawings on trees, singing and humming songs she learned to make for herself. That's very cute. Okay, we'll add her as well. Is she a teen? She is not. We're gonna make her a teen. Zarzu, yeah. Zarzu, yeah. Um, okay. Sir Governor, we found the cat. We have found the cat. Repeat, we have found the cat. Is this one Fearless BFF? Is she a young adult? Is that why? Yeah. <laughs> Making her a teen now. There you go. Yeah. All right, now we now we got it. Okay. Okay. Everybody's looking good. Go back to Chestnut Ridge. Let's add a cat to our family. 
This chat is a vibe. Yes, it is. Georgia, what's up? Glad you're here. All right, Governor Mittens, you are now officially the newest member of our of our family. What a cutie patootie. She's such a beautiful little bean. We love her. Governor Mittens. Oh, look at mom is so happy to have Governor, Governor Mittens in the fam. You can see her. She's like holding the baby like, ah, baby. Okay, now I can finally, finally. I would die for her. I am Bowie in the Lands of Bugs. That's true, buddy. It's me. <laughs> anyway, my little Bowie voice. It's not that much different than my voice, but a little bit different. You know what I mean? Where's governor? The governor has arrived. She's a perfect baby angel. Um, where's the new dad? Then, well, he, you know, he's still just a boyfriend. Okay, we're just getting to it. Uh, but let's uh, adjust the high school students. We're going to add more. We're going to add Abigail. We're going to add Darby. We're going to add Brent. Let me see who else. Jacqueline, Romeo, uh, Sha Chantal. Ooh, Ren looks cute, actually, too. I think that should be enough Sims. All right, so let's make the classes. We're going to add people to class. I think we already had, oh, Romeo, Rose. We can add Dory. We'll add, I don't know how many people are in class right now. Let me see the first class. Remove, no, I don't want to remove them. Let's try to figure out the classes. Remove, okay, so we have, we only have two people in that class, wait. <laughs> Hello? Okay, where's Juliet? What class is Juliet in? Excuse me. Okay, weird. Weird, but okay. Is she in class three? No, no one else is in any of these classes. Okay. Setting it up is a little buggy right now. I'm telling you what. Okay, Steven's there. Why am I not there? Maybe I should set it up on mom's. Maybe it's cause I'm playing as her. Let me see class one. Yep, it was because I was playing as Julia. Okay, so we're gonna have Julia in this class. Darby, we're gonna do maybe, I'm, I'm gonna do, how many people are? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So 18, what's 18 divided by three? Six, okay, there'll be six in each class. So we've got two already, two. We'll do Romeo, Rose, three. Uh, we'll do Dory four, uh, five, and then maybe an another Romeo six. Okay, cool. So that'll be the first class. Then high school student class three will be one, two, three, uh, four, five, and then Steven is six, and then the last class will be the last group of um class four will be bop, 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 bop. and is there a class two yes i don't know why oh we need to add faculty right teachers class one add okay that one woman is dead <laughs> teachers let's add some teachers then and remove some <laughs> what the heck we're gonna remove the dead teacher nope High school faculty, teachers, remove, read a combs. Sorry. Okay, high school students, faculty, teachers, add. Let's add a couple teachers. Oh my gosh, Agatha Crumblebottom would be a great teacher. So we need, so we have three, we need one more teacher. Oh my gosh, Ash as a teacher would be kind of cute because she's like from this pack, but she's like grew up obviously. Okay, high school students, faculty, teachers, class one. We already have class two. Wait. High school faculty, teachers, class one. Why are they all class one? That's weird. 
Okay. So we just need one. Oh, this is so... We don't need class two to have teachers. There's no class two. Class three. Hello? We'll just have Ash be... Or no. Technically, we had the other teacher there. We're almost done. <laughs> All right, cool. So Ash is the teacher of class four. So we got class one, three, and four already done. Class two, it doesn't have anyone. So that's great. Cafeteria, I believe we have them. I think everything else should be good. So we're done. Hopefully, setting everything up. Juliet, you're looking cutie as heck. Okay, keep working on your uh, practicing speech here. Steven is just gonna chill, I guess, uh, watch the yes. TV in his bedroom. <laughs> and Mary's gonna get to know our new friend here, the governor. What's up, governor? We have to grab all the rest. Oh, frisky. Governor Mitten is a frisky cat. They love to run around and might get hyper. Oh my God, how cute is that? Let's pull out all our cat stuff again. We're so happy the cats are back. Cats are back, baby. Back in the house. All right, love it. What's up, my governor? We're gonna give, we're gonna offer some friendship. We're gonna pet. It's governor time, baby. Oh, is it bean time? Did we reach the bean goal? Alora Den, uh, Den, thank you so much for three months. Let me see if we reached our sub goal. I think we did. Dang, okay, yeah, we did reach it. Um, Timmy Shimmy, thank you so much. Let me start a new goal. All right, we reached it ages ago. Oh, for serious? Why didn't anyone tell me? Grimster, thank you so much for reminding me to save. I'm gonna save the game here as well, because it's a good idea. Um, and I will return Mad Hatters and, uh, uh, Secret Life of Sammy, thank you so much for the um, gift of the deep breath together. So let's all take a deep breath in. And take a deep breath out. <laughs> Fabulous. Uh, I love how Mary's laser is a butterfly. So debut. Oh my gosh, that's so true. That's so cute. I love that. Um, okay. <laughs> so we do have a bean time. Let me grab my beans. All right, so the vote is, will it be a bean boozled or will it be a spicy bean? Do we have one of our mods around to start a little poll? Um, okay, here's Juliet. Still working hard on her first level of her skill here, her charisma skill that we have to max out. Um, a spicy bean. We're seeing mostly spicy. Kimba Yebu. Boo Jane. Uh, okay. Let's do. Let's manage our prediction here. Perfect. Spicy or boozled? Let's do it. I got you guys. There it happens. It's on. It's on. Uh, Twitch. You're wondering. Steven's here. Okay. We go to school, I think, tomorrow. Class in 19 hours. Let's do your homework. And your mom can help you with it. She's feeling very playful, which is cute. Let's uh, let's help with homework. Look who's here! It's Drew! Drew came over! Should we invite Drew to join our household? Okay, of course he went straight onto the computers. Let's, let's maybe have some computer security everyone but uh our daughter here so we're gonna make it just our daughter's computer here well computer for everyone but juliet and this one will be locked for everyone but him everyone but steven are you helping steven with his homework i think she is Perfect. Juliet's still working on her charisma. It's gonna be so charismatic. We're gonna be really proud of her. I'm gonna sell her toys because she doesn't really need them anymore. She's a big girl now. She doesn't need a. She doesn't need them. This kitchen reminds me of Mint. I know. Me too. I love Mint. 
I love the mint mintiness of this uh, era. It's very satisfying. Oh, look at Drew! Let's go give him like a big old hug or something. Yeah, give him a little love hug, love love and hug. Oh, she's gotta go to work. Okay, well she's going to work. Shoot, we're like 50 minutes late to work. Oh, whoops. But I'm sure she'll still get a promotion regardless. But Steven's gonna hang out with him. Come sing out with Drew. Ask about ask about the community. You know, he's gonna talk to him about stuff. Juliet's still vibing. Drew did oh Drew needs to use the restroom. Okay. Well, or Steven does, I mean, sorry. Drew's over here. You he's like, howdy, Drew. It's good to see you. Miss you. Share a secret. Yeah. Juliet, you better wrap up here. I love governors just vibing in the bathroom as well. Should give some pets to the governor. Let's do some good. I want some really good pets. Drew is uncomfy. Why is Steven feeling very flirty? Oh, watch the romantic comedy. He's like, maybe I'll be finding love. I mean, Steven also needs some love, I think, you know? So maybe in high school. Hey, Mary, Emron Watson asked me out on a date. Should I say yes? Yes, romance is in the air. He's like, get out, girl. She's like, okay, fine. Fine, I'll go hang out with Drew. Steven's peeing with her. He's like, I'm just gonna pee with you in the room if you don't leave. Go with you in the room, sister. <laughs> oh. She's gonna chat with Drew a bit, I'm ask him about stuff. Oh my God, are you okay? <laughs> Governor Mitten out of control. Jeez. Absolute Jeez. crazy. Jeez. I, I, oh, you, you spelled governor wrong. Jeez. That's okay, it's Jeez. cute. I like it. Joy. <laughs> okay, he's just text to text him. Julia, I think you need to go use the restroom once you're done here too. I'm excited for them to finally get to go to high school. Are you gonna go? Go to the restroom, yeah, there you go. Hopefully we go soon. I'm gonna speed through this day a bit. Use the shower and then wash. Oh God. That means we'll just replace it. It's a cheap, it's a cheap sink. It's fine. We have some money saved up. We should really get going. Bye, see you later. All right, bye, Drew. Thanks for hanging out with the kids while mom was gone at work. So sweet. Maybe he should move in, I don't know. Um, don't forget the bean. I have not, thank you for reminding me. It's bean time, baby, you guys voted. So let's find out which it's going to be. Remy's like, what is that? Okay, here we go. This is the bean. Oh, it looks like a bean boozled. I wonder if it's gonna be gross or good. We'll find out. I'm gonna just put my aligners over here. Okay. All good, all right, let's eat this bean. Find out what it is. It is, <gasps> it's pear. It's a good bean, oh my God. Whoa! Whoa. That was a good boozled bean. Dang, okay. Delicious. What a surprise. That was a good time. You guessed good bean and a, be a bean boozled. You were right. If you missed around this time, I'm sorry. We'll have to do it again soon. Here you go. Got my teeth back in. All right, let's keep going. Sibling hangout time. Oh, she was playing piano as a kid, wasn't she? So let's have her still play piano. I think that's cute. She wanted to play piano. Steven really wants to take care of a horse and win a master horse competition. I wonder if he could buy 
a book about horses. Or he could like read up about it. Yes. Okay, we're going to buy him all the horse books. And then he's going to be able to read the horse books. So he'll learn how to do that while he's... Believe it or not, I got the new job. Yay, good job. What's his job now? He's an assistant dishwasher at Make a Dish. Oh, cool. He wants to be a cook. That's so cool. Well, go off, Drew. I love that for him. Dun, 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 dun. Is she good? Oh, yeah. She's getting a promotion today for sure. Juliet's still kind of... Plunk plunking at the piano here. Her charisma is almost level three, so that's great. Pretty good for one day, you know what I mean? Actually, no, we don't want her to practice a debate. We want her to practice her speech. That's what it is. We don't need research and debate. We need her to be charismatic. There it is, level three of charisma. Okay, now she just needs to be more comedic, so maybe we can tell some jokes. We'll just tell a joke about acne, rough, joke about body hair. <laughs> Hopefully he thinks they're funny. Joke about penguins. I mean, it is her brother, so he's probably fine. <laughs> joke about facial hair. I'm going to just give her all of the funny jokes. So that way she can ho hopefully start working on this comedy skill. Yeah, she acquired the comedy skill. Go off, girl. Keep working on your comedy routine. And mom has been promoted. Oh my gosh, look at her dress. Instrumental wonder. Mary has been promoted to instrumental wonder. She will now make an additional, um, ooh, she makes a lot of money now. And is she, what level is she on the, on the career? Musician level nine. So she needs to, her violin or guitar needs to be level eight. She's not quite there yet, but that's okay. Let's go take care of her needs. Let's go, girl. I love your little fit for your... Take a little sing in the shower moment, as always. Maybe grab some dinner with the kids. I don't think the kids have eaten dinner yet, either. They're chatting over his book, which I'll return. Don't eat that for dinner. They both want cake for dinner. I'm like, bro, there's better stuff for dinner than cake. What are you doing? Get some food food. Get get leftovers. Jeez, you guys got salad to eat. The governor is looking adorable in her mittens. Go off, Governor Mittens. Mary's having a good little time in the shower. She's gonna go grab some of the taco casserole for dinner. Have the dinner with the kids. Look at them! All three having dinner at the same time. This is so rare. And Mary got up. Yeah, that seems about right. Or Juliet did. Juliet, do you want to watch a comedy show? Or comedy channel? Yeah, go watch comedy. Hopefully that'll help your comedy skill. She's like... This is hilarious. Everything is so funny. Oh God, she's hysterical. I don't think teens can die from this, but I'm gonna save here just in case, okay? <laughs> you think the cat is stuck? Oh no! Let's, let's, uh, let's have our, let's, can we move our cat? Okay, what about now? Can you move now? Come here, governor. There we go. Governor's unstuck now. We're learning some comedy though. Go girl. Governor's just chatting. What are you what are you crawling out? What's wrong? What's wrong, Governor? Did you really let your number leak into the net? Haha, <laughs> just another dumb celeb, says Daryl Charm. What a jerk. Why don't you check what's wrong? You go ask the cat what's wrong since you're just standing up there, Steven. Steven, go check on with, with the mayor what is wrong. What is wrong, Mayor? Or, I mean, Governor. Governor Mittens, what is wrong? Anything? Oh. Okay, she's a little tired. Why don't we play some, practice some guitar? 
finish up this skill really quick so you can get another promotion. Steven, why don't you fill up the bowl here? Okay, she's done. Perfect. Why don't you go to sleep? Steven's going to fill up the bowl for the cat, and then he's going to go to sleep. And Juliet is finishing up her comedy skill. She is going to be level two very soon. Nope. All right. She's going to bed, apparently. Okay, good night, everyone. The governor has gone to the restroom, and the governor is, is checking out their bed, coming in or out. I love it. Read it day was awful. Oh, okay, well, sorry I didn't buy anything on rebate day. Was, I bought everything the day before. And now governor's asleep in their bed. She's looking great. And school is today. Next day of school is happening. I'm so excited. Okay, I should start waking these kids up because they got about an hour till school starts. So you guys should get up, get ready, use the toilet, get some food. And you, Steven, need to shower and use the bathroom, but he also needs food. So he's gonna eat cake for breakfast. Of course he is. He's been really wanting that cake for breakfast for a few minutes and I'm gonna allow it. I'm gonna allow it. I'm going to allow it. All right, he needs to use the toilet and take a shower as well. Once you're done with your cake for breakfast. Juliet, what are you having for breakfast? Eggs and toast, perfect, perfect breakfast. She's having it at the piano, looking out the window. She likes sitting over here. I think mom is just chilling. She she and the mayor are. Ah, oh, it's time for school! We're gonna select what students to follow and it's gonna be Juliet and Steven. I'm so excited. Oh wait, I realize there's only like two classrooms in this build, huh? So one of the student, the one group of students won't have a classroom. We need to upgrade the, the, the um, school. I think we'll be able to do that after. Crispy Cool Beans, thank you so much for gifting five gifted subs. And Maddie Elizabeth, thank you so much for gifting a sub. And No Blonde, happy, thank you for the resub. Oh my goodness, Panty Page just What's gave out subs. Up? Oh my gosh. A wild Oprah appeared. Thank you guys so so much. Oh my goodness, so we're at school now. Unfortunately, the school only has two classrooms and we have six or three groups of students and I can't change the, the school while we're at the school. So it is one of those, but we're looking good. I mean, standing out from the crowd is for sure her vibe right now. Uh, here's Steven hanging out and look at all your guys' sims are here. Here's Romeo Rose, Aaron Brinkley, Misha Black, who looks pretty mad that he's in a uniform right now. We got Jacqueline, who is throwing around a pig skin. We got Karen Caliente. You guys didn't make her, but I think she's really cool. Uh, we got our girl, uh, um, Arnie, Annie. And we got our girl over here, Darby. Looking good, looking good. We even have a... Uh, Leland and I believe there's like another sim here it is yeah Brent Boster we got Romeo Knight the other Romeo we love to see it so many great teens and it's our first day at school loving it okay let's go oh and there's oh my gosh look who's here it's Dory they're already t posing in the hall love that Dory keep it up where's our principal do we not have a principal I I feel like we do. I think we do, but I don't know where the principal is. So that's okay. Let's get some lockers. Okay. We're going to go over here, I think. And Steven will get the locker right next to her. Oh, Steven's taking a shower here. Honestly, that's probably a really good idea. Oh, wait. This, there, there they are. This is the principal, May. Here is hanging out with Agatha and also Ash Harjo, who is one of our teachers, which I think is adorable because she went to high school here. Look at all the students hanging out, running on treadmills, chatting at the gym. It's just so much, just so much fuller now with all these students in the class. Okay, she claimed her locker. Let's decorate it with academia. Yeah, oh wait, that's giving folklore. It's not giving a uh, speak now. Let's do, or not speak now. Let's, uh, 
Let's maybe do preppy decorations. Would that be better? That's kind of cute. I like it. That'll be fine. We're going to do that one. He's going to decorate his with um, be grunge? Eco-enthusiast? Maybe eco-enthusiast because he likes the outdoors. He's going to take a shower though. He really needs it because he's stinky. And Juliet, why don't you meet some new students? Who's around? Okay. This is Romeo Knight is here. So let's go introduce ourselves to Romeo Knight in the club. In the Ooh, look at her popping down the hallway. Oh my goodness. I skipped Jeanette. I'm well, I'm sure she's still here in the classroom, in the school, even if I didn't specifically point her out. <laughs> she's like saying, hi, yeah. Romeo Knight. It's good to meet Yo, you. Saba. You know, discuss his interests. Okay. And then we're going to go meet Aaron Brinkley. Go introduce ourselves to him as well here's uh abigail woods she's hopping in the school um hmm anyone else anyone else wanna wanna meet up here we go there's uh Chantel. song is over there she's introducing herself to aaron as well okay she's gonna go get ready for classes class time steven steven get out of the shower go to class juliet's going to her class Listen to Romeo complain. Okay, Romeo's complaining about something. I don't know what. Uh, we're all good here though, right? We're all good. Let's go to class. Okay, we're going to class. Bye team. But this Romeo, I don't know. I've got eyes for him. Maybe it's just because he's got freckles, but I really love the freckles. Oh my gosh, she's sitting right behind him in class. Look at him. Look at all the students. Wait, why is my brother in this class with me? I'm pretty sure I put Steven in class number two, but I guess maybe the classes are combined since there's only one classroom. Wait, why is no one in this room? Where the rest of the students go? They're all just bopping around. Okay. Maybe I needed to assign the classrooms or something. I don't know. Where's the teacher? Okay, well, <laughs> we're just studying on our own, I guess. We're getting our culture stuff learning. That's okay though. We should get on social media because that's what I always want to do. Ooh, some Sims question local laws, regulations, policies, and taxes, but those are usually Sims who can vote. These are potentially weeks before Steven needs to worry about this politics stuff. Time for a social media update. Oh yeah, he's going to send it out. Steven pulls out his phone and starts to browse social media when he hears a polite cough. Steven glitzes to find the teacher's gaze locked on him. He sighs and stuffs his phone back into his pocket. Small classroom performance lost. New post on Social Bunny, though. That's cute. All right, speaking of Social Bunny, let's open it and start adding to our contacts. We're going to include Romeo and um, Aaron. Perfect. Okay, and then is there anyone else? No, we probably don't want any of those people yet. Okay, what about you? Do you have anybody to, to add? Juliet, he's got Eliana Jang, I think, and him are friends. And yeah, that's about it. Okay. I want to see his social bunny post that he posted, though. <laughs> I want to see it. A pillow smack to my soul. It will take days to crawl out of this hole of sadness. Oh, no. That's cute. Okay. We're going to have to meet everybody before the end of day. But look who's also in our class. So cute. Let's meet Darby. Ugh, Friendly introduction to these two Sims. Maybe Steven's going to meet Romeo Knight and all of these Sims. I'm just trying to, trying to meet everybody. So that we can all become kind of friends. Be friendly with a faculty member. Tell an unbelievable story. Give Brighton day. Oh, wow. Why is Dory so frustrated? I don't know. Maybe it's because the, the teacher didn't show up. That's probably why. Is the, high, is the class full of Romeos like the five Kyles of schools? Yes, the school is full of Romeos. <laughs> Which is funny to me. <laughs> she have a crush on anyone yet? Okay. Discuss interests. Go go hang out with Darby at lunch. Oh my gosh. Our bills need to be paid or we have we're gonna get 
Julia has a crush on Abigail. Okay, Juliet. Okay. She's thinking Abigail's the cutie over here. Oh, she's got she's got glitches again with the rings. That's fun. That's fun. Okay. Crushing on Abigail. I was kind of going for a Romeo, but that's okay. We can crush on Abigail too. <clears throat> uh, let's go eat uh, these other Sims out here. Try to just meet everybody. Uh, same with Steven. Steven, can you meet everyone? I think he's already met her. Yeah. Oh, downplay stress. Don't do that. That's mean. You've already met him? No, he hasn't. Okay. We're trying to meet everybody. Uh, I'm so jealous of you right now. My laptop is too slow to run The Sims now. I need a new laptop. Oh, no. I hope that it all gets sorted out soon. She's hanging out with everybody, chatting, getting to know everyone. Steven's getting to know everyone. Steven, do you need some food? Why don't you get some food? She is pretty good with food, but... She's chatting with everyone, meeting everybody. It's still early days. Um, but yeah, maybe, you know, maybe Abigail might be the first person she dates, but not the person that she like really falls for. That could be kind of fun. So maybe we'll like, I don't know. We gotta add each other on Social Bunny, obviously. I could totally see her uh, dating Abigail like first. But uh, Abigail might not like her, so <laughs> just maybe she gets her heart crushed by Abigail and there's like, love is dumb. My mom struggled in love and I'm struggling in love, so I don't care anymore. <laughs> but then, uh, yeah, that could be kind of funny. That'd be a funny little <laughs> turn of event. Abigail just breaks her heart. Um, okay, more social bunny. I'm gonna add all of the friends here. Darby, Romeo, Abigail, or what if her, him and, what if Steven and his sister both have crushes on Abigail? That would be drama too. Oh wait, no, not Jay. Remove Jay. Yeah, perfect. Okay, we're all becoming friends and everything is great. <coughs> Did you ever get your food, Steven? <laughs> Oh, oh Steven's meeting um no. meeting Misha Black. Did you ever get your food, Bull? Here he comes. He's gonna go get his food now. <coughs> and Juliet's just still chatting with literally everyone. Oh, she has like leftovers from home. She brought leftovers from home to eat. That's so cute. Awkward encounter. We should do like a bold pickup line, see how it goes. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> she liked it. Okay. Abigail seemed to like our little flirting. Oh, wow. She's flirty. Okay. She likes us. <laughs> okay. Bye, Abigail. <laughs> Steven, you going to go to class? Or he, yeah, he's finishing eating up. He's going to hit up class. Juliet's in class here. We'll maybe put the plate away somewhere else. Maybe, Juliet. Put in the class in the... Okay, we're all on our phones now, which is great. <laughs> Love it. Okay, now they're in their language arts class. This is awesome. Do I need to add anyone else on Social Bunny? Okay, Karen, we met Karen. Perfect. What about him? First day of school stuff, you know, gotta get everything sorted. Misha. Um, and that's that because those are all just faculty and we don't want that. So uh -huh. bye. <laughs> Sometimes I hate it when my sim decides they have a crush. I'm like, I'm in control. I decide who you like. Yeah, I definitely wasn't feeling a romance between these two, but like it could be fun. I don't know. Did you add Jeanette in the social bunny? She is my sim. I, we haven't met Jeanette yet, but we will um, shortly. I've, I've included everyone that we've met so far, but we haven't met every student yet. So we're working on it. Uh, I have to admit, mine was a little more darker when it was similar to having the green gen. Mm. Oh. And not so very, she had a whirlwind romance, end up pregnant, and the baby daddy or mama, as it seems, end up dead before she gives birth. Ah! That happened to my green gen. 
Um, I only get Sims stuff whenever my sister wants it, but my sister got bored of Sims, so I hope the sales will let me get some stuff. You got this. End of the day report. Okay, Steven turned in some good work and took some good notes, and Juliet impressed her teachers and learned a lot. That's great. Good job, team. Is there anything else on the school calendar today? Is there anything going on? It's Geek Con today. But neither of these are like really geeky sims. Let's see if we've met everyone. We met Abigail, we met Abigail, Romeo, we've met Darby, we've met Dory. We haven't met uh, Brent yet. Oh, he's feeling flirty, okay. Romeo, maybe he's a crush on us. <laughs> We're gonna be a heartbreaker. And then where's the rest of the sims? Okay, they're all out here. Here's Martina. We can do funny introduction to you, to Chantel. To Misha, to Jacqueline, to Jeanette. Love Jeanette. Here's Aaron. Okay. We're going around. We're making sure we meet everyone. Has he met you yet? Yeah, he has. He has. Yep. Darby. Nope. Let's go introduce ourselves to everyone. <laughs> the T-Pose challenge is so cute. Leland, Arnie. Yeah, we're, we're making the rounds. Juliet's introducing herself to Martina, who's very cute. So many cute Sims to introduce ourselves to. We're, putting, we're walking around. It's first day at school. Everyone wants to meet each other and hang out. Juliet's meeting everybody, it seems. We'll see who we get along with. I love it. I love it. I can't wait till like the after school activities come in. I love that they're all wearing the same t-shirts today, which is funny. After our, we painstakingly gave you all clothes again, and then you decided to walk into school wearing like your like chess team or whatever t-shirts. Okay, did you meet Misha? All right, we're going through. Steve is getting a phone call. I saw you, what you did last week. I was there. I saw everything. You're in big trouble. Wait, who is this? Haha, you got pranked. All right, well, that's rude. But here we are with Jeanette. We're making friends, hanging out. So far, so good. Tell a joke about a horse, of course. He's gonna tell a joke. Juliet's chilling. Seems like she's met everyone, or she's going to meet everyone. Okay, we're slowly but surely meeting everybody. But this is, I mean, this is my favorite male sim, I'm not gonna lie. He's so cute. We should like, we should, uh, we should become besties and then we fall in love. That'd be cute. Kind of like a very you belong with me vibes where like they become besties, but it might be the opposite because he might be the one that's like, you belong with me, you belong with me. She's like, what do you mean? I don't know. I'm just so funny. I'm gonna say all the jokes as usual. <gasps> Wait, <laughs> Julia has a major crush again. She has two crushes. Wow, we that sim is irresistible. Julia has a major crush on Romeo. Boom, baby. She's crushing on the boy. That is so cute. I love <laughs> And he's immediately feeling flirty, so I think he's crushing on our Juliet, which is that's a fun face, Juliet. I love it. That's hilarious. She's got two crushes immediately on the first day. That is so a Juliet thing, I think, that she would do, honestly. Okay, don't romance him. We're just trying to give him jokes right now. <laughs> Joke about aliens. Everyone finds me hilarious, and we're now level two of the comedy skill. Mm, well. Knock, knock, joke. <laughs> Look, all the students are hanging. This is so cute. Everyone's cracking up at our jokes. We're so funny. <laughs> I'm hilarious. She like loves that validation. She's like, I am going to be the funniest, most charismatic person that you've ever met. Just watch me. But she's got a big old fat crush on Romeo Rose and also Abigail apparently. So that's hilarious. Ryder wants to, wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. <sighs> yeah, fine. 
My brother and I will go to your house and hang out. I didn't even know he had a house. I kind of ship, ship Steve and Abigail. I kind of do too. I love this idea that Steven starts dating her and then like her and Steven kind of go through like a bad patch a little bit. Could be fun, but Romeo and Juliet be crushing on each other. But here we go, you know, there's gonna be a bunch of drama. Oh, okay, he's got this like apartment. He's got this like shipping container apartment kind of thing. It's very simple, but I'm happy for you, dad. Maybe he's like, I wanna show you guys my new place. We're like, oh, okay, cool. I'm gonna tell him a funny story because I'm hilarious now. It's like my whole thing. Steven's dying from the, the stuff outside. So let's go, there's nothing in this place though <laughs> i guess you're gonna go sit why don't you go sit upstairs and do your homework juliet's gonna chat with her dad who's scared why are you scared <laughs> well let's try to console him be like dad there's no reason to be paranoid except for of course the fact that it's disgusting inside but it's all good let's go together inside somewhere dad okay let's go in here could chat here my brother's gonna go upstairs i think okay are you gonna be, are you good like let's let's tell an unbelievable story because she's so confident and then we're gonna try to console him probably won't work again we're gonna start telling jokes we're gonna be like oh i have a funny story for you about school today maybe i'll make some funny faces i'll just try to add my comedy skill here she's like that's i'm too funny i'm hilarious dad tell a joke about penguins steven's in the other room working on his homework so good job visiting dad while, while mom is still at work anyway so that's kind of good but i don't know why he's scared i think he's a little scared they're jokesters oh that's cute that her dad and her like he loves this funny side of her. Oh, that's so cute. What about She's almost to level three of her comedy, which is awesome. Go, girl. He's feeling very playful with her, which is cute. I think Juliet's just very like charming. She's just a very charming person. Uh, I wish that you had a mirror for her to practice her speeches, but it's all good. She does need to use a restroom. So let's go use the toilet. Why is there a candelabra in here? I don't know. It's a little weird, but okay. I'm gonna use that. Dad, do you have any food to speak of? It doesn't even look like you have a fridge in your kitchen, which I'm assuming is that. You know, he's just moved in. Maybe we'll have to grill something. I'm a little nervous to have my teenage daughter grill though. I feel like she's gonna definitely start a fire. Why don't you take a nice little shower? Quink and tepid shower. Let's just take a shower. Okay, let's not be crazy gonna take a little shower steven's working on his homework being a good kid almost done he's always been a really good kid juliet's also a very good kid too uh she gives goofball vibes she does give goofball vibes oh god she's going upstairs to grill i don't know that makes me nervous let's let's sit there's only this to sit on too steven needs to use the toilet Mary's Mary's home. You know what? Let's go home since our mom's home. Julia, I don't want you grilling. So we're going to go home and have dinner with mom. But thank you for having us over, dad. It was really great to see your new place. Hope you get a fridge soon. And Julia's going home. Perfect. <laughs> oh, yeah. My my red gen. Her name was Poppy. That is true. Oh, good time. All right, we're home. And look who's here. It's Drew. I think we should just ask him to move in. Romance. Or no. Friendly. Ask to move in. Ask to join household. Yeah, we're going to just ask him to join us in the household here. Juliet needs to eat and do her homework. So let's get some leftovers here. Mary's gonna go ask her boyfriend to, so she needs to pay her bills. Okay. Oh, so cute. My kids are just hanging out. Can we watch? Can we watch comedy instead? Yeah. Okay. Him and his horse are gonna move in. 
I'm a little nervous. Sell all of lot furnishings. Sure. Not that you had any. Oh, maybe you did. Okay. So we need to make some space for the horse outside. Since now we have a horse. Steven's going to be thrilled about that. Um, Let's put this outside here. Put that over there. We're going to put the water trough here. And then I think there's like a little hay. Yeah, little guy here. I think this horse might like, you know, being in the outdoors. So I don't know if I need to add too much more to that. Drew can go fill up the feeder for the horse. So now we have a horse. And Steven, actually Steven will probably take care of the horse more than... Not that Drew won't take care of his own horse by, but Steven was like thrilled. He's like, yeah, I'm going to go take care of the horse. Don't worry about me. And we're going to watch Comedy Channel as well because we love it. We can't get enough. But Steven's like, I'll take care of the horse. I'll take care of it. Don't you worry about a thing. I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to be on horse duty for sure. Hanging out with the horse. Oh my gosh, Mary must be so excited. She gotta pay her bills still, Mary. Everyone's excited that Drew's finally moved in. Right side is Mary, so left side will be Drew. There we go. Family's all chilling. Juliet, maybe do your homework really fast, please. And thank you. Steven's hanging. Drew's hey, chatting with mom. He wants to be friendly to livestock. Oh, so cute, because he's a rancher. I forgot. But he's got a new job, right? It's assistant dishwasher. Yeah. So he's got to prepare food. So let's like cook something for everybody out of like a cute little... Does he even have the ability to cook anything yet? Maybe we should start him easy with like a... Yeah, no, he's level one of cooking, because it was great. Okay. Let's do uh, some onigiri. We'll do a family size. <laughs> he likes deception. Okay. That's random, but okay. He's like, yeah, I loved it. I love that you deceived me. Mary, are you helping? You're chatting with Juliet. Why don't you help her with her homework so she gets it done faster? I love that Julia just decided to kneel outside so she could hang out with her mom. So cute. Did we do the, do we pay the bills finally? We did finally pay the bills. Thank goodness. Drew's cooking a bit. Getting used to it. Oh, and his horse is outside. Teardrop. Teardrop is fun as poor, but that's okay. Teardrop, you're going to have Steven always helping you have fun from now on. So do not worry about it. Oh, teardrops on comfy. Okay, Steven, it's all you. You said you wanted to help. So why don't you clean up the manure and scratch and talk to the horse. Go take care of the horse at midnight. He's like, oh, I would love nothing more than to take care of this horse. I've been, I've been waiting for this my whole life. Tell a joke. He's going to really enjoy the horse time. Oh, he's taking out the garbage. I don't know if we need you to do that, but it's already too late. He's already doing it. Juliet's going to bed. Good night, Juliet. Good night. Steven's taking care of horse. Drew is gonna was gonna go take care of his horse, but then saw that he was doing it, so he was kind of like, okay. Let's prepare. Let's cook something else. Do a little grilled cheese moment. Just try it out. Hopefully we don't light anything on fire. He's working on his dream of being a chef. Steven's working on his dream of becoming best friends with a horse. He's only 75% done with his homework. I feel like that keeps happening. Or my, my Sims will do some of their homework, but not all of it. It's like, why? Did Juliet finish her homework? She did. Okay. I don't know. Drew is cooking level two. Good job, Drew. Why don't you... Okay, the horse is fine. Why don't you just go to bed? Oh, he's going to talk with the... With the... With the governor. He's talking to the governor. Offer some friendship and give some treats. We're going to bribe Governor Mitten to love us. Obviously. Um, Zoomies alert for the governor. 
Governor had some zoomies. Love that. We're gonna have you go to bed soon too. Okay. Good night, King. There he goes. Going to bed. Hey, the governor's zoom, zooming around. Teardrop is chilling, enjoying life. Teardrop's good. Teardrop's happy. Steven's definitely gonna be riding Teardrop very soon. And now we're all asleep except for Teardrop, who's vibing. I think there is like, yeah, there's a place to play with Teardrop like right next door. So that'll be perfect. Yeah, we could like do some jumping and stuff with Teardrop. Ooh, Mary needs to pee. Her living boyfriend with her family. Sleeping in her house for the first time. So cute. She's gonna grab some leftovers. We're never gonna have to cook again because this man's gonna be cooking all the time. Oh God, that was broken. Guess who can fix it? It's our boyfriend, okay. School time, we gotta get some food. Oh, he's angry, why? Just cause you're a teen. Oh, a social bunny post. Oh no, what was it? I wanna know what people are saying to you. All right. Hey, bestie, hope you're having an excellent day, said Misha. Oh, thanks. Steven, I thought you had a crush. I uh, thought about taking the guitar. I think you'd crush it. Oh, Abigail flirting with him. Okay, everybody seems like nice to him. Is somebody... <gasps> Steven said something sassy. He said, Juliet, your face is so punchable. Just make, looking at it makes me want to throw it out. <laughs> He's so mean. Oh, Julia was like, in my hands, a pillow must be classified as a dangerous weapon. I think that she smacked him with a pillow and he's kind of mad about it. So that's really cute. I want to see if Juliet has any fun social bunny experiences. Let's see. No one's messaged her yet. Interesting. Interesting. We got to add Misha, Chantal, Arnie, Brent, uh, Martina, and that's all of them that she knows at the moment. We'll add some more on his. So many Sims here. Arnie, Leland, Jeanette, Jacqueline, Karen, and that's it. Perfect. Okay, so we've got a lot, a lot of uh, friends, things that we've said too. But okay, this is hilarious. I love it all. So good. They're all having breakfast together before school, which is so cute. You let eat your grilled cheese. Dr grilled cheese for breakfast honestly sounds like such a good idea. And Drew is working on fixing the shower. Thanks, Drew. He's like, don't worry. <laughs> all right, we're gonna select Juliet and Steven, go out with them. Why is he so angry? Yeah, probably hormones, probably because Juliet's been sassing him on uh, social media. So then he sassed her back and then got grumpy. <laughs> um, do, I do see the TikTok comments, um, but I'm glad you caught my stream too, Corbin. It's hard to balance everything. So <laughs> apologies if uh, I'm not getting to all of it. Oh my God, I love this fit on her with her hair. It's so cute. Everyone's in their fits today, their usual outfits. None of this crazy mumbo jumbo. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, Juliet's in her sweet little dress today. Looking cute, ready for school. But I'm gonna save this right here and leave us here. I had so much fun streaming a little extra long with you guys. Um, but I'm getting hungry, so it's time for me to go grab some lunch. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your weekend. Um, if you're still on Sunday today with me, um, but yeah, I had so much fun with you guys. I hope you had fun too. And I'll see you guys all on Tuesday. And on Tuesday, we'll be doing a custom content stream. So we'll be shopping, custom content shopping for my blue gen of the Not So Berry Challenge. So that's gonna be a lot of fun. So I'll see you all then.